Hey beautiful people, you're welcome to my channel. My name is Beauty Sarah and Terry Fred and if you're new here, you're welcome to the family, a world of beauties and positive people. So in today's video guys, I'm going to be doing your makeup on this beautiful model. <laughs> she's my sister do. So she's my model for today and I'm going to be transforming her face. So guys, stay tuned for the what? For the look <laughs> so guys um first thing first i have to shape the brows to put it in shape and i'm using a razor blade and i cannot really shave with a full razor blade so i do um cut my razor blade into two to shave so i'm done shaving next thing i'm wiping her face with a baby wipe to cleanse the face from every form of dirt and i'm using classic primer to prime my face so I'm using my hand to apply the primer so that it will settle very well into our skin so my, I'm taking my time to apply the primer yes I'm applying the primer that is what I'm still doing applying it all over the face I'm applying the primer all over the face because I do not want my makeup to break. Now after that guys, I went in with my Flawless Ivy Setting Spray to set um, the face. Next thing, I went in with my Zikel Foundation. I used um, Zikel brushes, so I just showed you guys. Then, that Zikel shade of foundation was not that shade, so I have to mix it with a darker shade of Avo. Like, this foundation is so good, Avo. Very good, like, very, very good and very affordable. So, I mixed that Zikel shade with this darker shade of Avo to get a color. To get a color. So, I'm applying the foundation right now with my Beauty Blender. Taking my time to apply the foundation. Take my time to apply the foundation and make sure that is okay next thing i went in with my elegant pro concealer and when i'm applying my concealer i don't like to apply too much i just apply little <laughs> that's what i do because i don't want it to start breaking so i just apply little to alight under the eyes the jaw the nose the forehead so i went in with my beauty blender to blend very well like i take my time to blend until i'm satisfied with the blending so next thing guys i went in with my zk setting powder to bake the areas that i elected using my beauty blender to apply the setting powder and so first use brush but i use um beauty blender because it just works perfectly for me like it sinks in <laughs> when i use the um what's it called the beauty blender to apply the setting powder it sinks in so next thing i went in with my brush to dust it off immediately like i don't allow my um, setting powder to take time or bake but i just put it and take it off immediately and it works like that for me it works for me so dusting it off and make sure making sure that it's okay it's okay it's coming up well yeah so guys next thing i went in with my ferrarushi concealer palette and i'm using the dark shade to contour the hollows of our face i'm using the dark shade of ferrarushi um concealer palette as my cream contour to contour the hollows of her face, contour her nose and um, her hairline. So I'm doing cream contour and I'm taking my time because I don't want any ash lines. So guys, I'm taking my time. Then I went in with my blush. I did. Um, I went in with my, after the contour. I applied blush immediately so that it will come out. When I apply blush like this, it comes out better. So after that, guys, I went in with my powder. Use the shade of a powder. I'm using the Zike powder palette to um, set the remaining part of her face. Applying powder 
on the remaining part of our face so that um, it can be done with the skin work so yeah so you may still applying the powder to blend with the areas that I highlighted so that everything will come out well so just allow you guys to watch the way I'm doing it so guys next thing is the drawing of the brows and I use um, edge control gel to set the brows so I started using edge control gel like the brow comes out very well so I'm using edge control gel to set the brows it makes it look more natural then I went in with my Davis pencil to draw the brows just let me know if you want me to do a brow tutorial and I will do that so I draw a line underneath then draw a line up then I'm not the line that I'm drawing up I'm not starting from the beginning like the way I did it on that so that it will look natural then I'm drawing a stroke like look like drawing for the brows if that makes sense so yeah just taking my time drawing my brows and next thing I'm highlighting highlighting the brows using Firarushi concealer using the shade that is lighter than A then for the origin the beginning of the brow I'm using a darker shade so that it will look more natural yeah, I'm taking my time when I'm highlighting my brows like I take my time I like it when my brows are looking perfect because I'm a fan of good brows so I went in with my blending brush to blend very well blend so that there will be no ash lines everything will just be looking clean and neat so next thing I'm highlighting the top of our brows using a shade of foundation I'm using a shade of foundation to uh, to highlight the top of our brows. Um, yes, I'm taking my time because yes, after that, went in my blending brush, blending brush, sorry, to blend. The next thing I'm applying using the white shade of concealer in my concealer palette as my eyeshadow primer. So. After applying it, I went to my blending brush, my blending brush, sorry, to um, blend the concealer. The next thing, I went in with powder, a lighter shade of powder, to set the brows, so that those ash lines will not be showing. The next thing, I'm going in with my V Beauty shadow palette, V Beauty shadow palette. So I'm using um, the Peachy Nude. For the crease for the crease area then for the outer part of the eye um, I use um, three colors dark purple black and dark red or us blood so that's the three colors that gave me this color that I'm using for the outer parts of the eyes the next thing I went in with the shimmer shadow uh, it's um, a darker gold that is what I'm using. Taking my time to apply it. Um, taking my time. Like is uh, I think it's a peachy kind of gold. Yeah. Peachy kind of gold. I either use this color or I use gold. I'm a fan of gold shadows. Then I realized that the shadow we are falling off. So I had to set her eyes again with some um, setting powder so that I can easily dust it off and the shimmer shadow will not stain her, her face. So now I'm going with my blending brush again and blending out the crease very well. So sorry guys, um, never took the light so I could not show you when I fix her lashes and use the underliner. So sorry about that. The next thing. Um, I'm using my Davis Pencil as my lip liner. I'm using Davis Pencil as my brown lip liner. As you can see, I'm taking my time. 
taking my time to try the liner yeah then i went in with my zika lip gloss the nude shade so i'm using my brush to blend the davis pencil and the zika nude liner nude lipstick together <laughs> i'm taking my time so yeah I like my work to come up very well, like I'm a fan of perfection. Then after that guys, I went in with the Zika lip gloss. So to apply on it because I love glossy lips. Yeah. And after that it actually came out better and just made it pop yes i'm using the zika lip gloss with um the davis pencil and the zika nude lipstick nude lip gloss rather and i'm using my brush to blend it so after that guys i'm using my brush to dust off the ss setting powder yeah then i'm setting the remaining part of her face with a powder shade from my zk palette don't mind the powder <laughs> i'll get a better one soon so okay next thing i'm going in with my zk glow dust like this dust is very nice like very very nice it comes out so well you don't even need to apply too much really little and you see the face glowing so i'm taking my time i love taking my time when i'm working on people's face because i want it to come out well as you can see next thing i went in with my setting spray to set the face yeah so we are done and um, my sister is the one styling the hair she's a hair stylist by the way so she's the one styling the hair yeah so i'm done with the makeup so guys this is it this is what the makeup is looking like <laughs> this is what it's looking like it's looking flawless looking clean and I'm a fan of soft glam like I don't like my makeup loud looking loud or looking shouty I just want it very soft and very light yeah so we are done this is what the makeup is looking like right now So guys that is it for today's video if you know you haven't subscribed to me please subscribe to me subscription is free help your sister see you guys in my next video love you so much bye